Hi, and thank you for watching. Today, what we are going to do is customize our Tmux status bar. So the first thing that we want to do is load Tmux with the Tmux command. And on the very bottom of our window, we see this green status bar with black text. And what we can do is send a command to Tmux to let it know that we want to use different colors. So the first thing we need to do is enter into command mode. And the way we do that is by inserting the prefix key, which is control B, followed by the colon. And the command here is set option status style FG for foreground, the colors we want, BG for background, and also the color that we want. And then we just hit enter. So as you can see on the very bottom of my screen, I now have my custom colors. The problem with this though is that this change is not persistent. So if I load another Tmux environment, the bar is green as it initially was. And the way that we work around this is we can create a custom Tmux configuration file in our home directory that will be used on startup. So let's go ahead and create that file now. In your home directory, create this file .tmux.conf with the command that we wish to run. And that command was set option minus G for global status style FG equals white BG equals black. So I am going to save this. And one thing to keep in mind is that if you have a separate instance open of Tmux like I do here on my left window, the new changes will not take effect until we kill Tmux completely. So the easy way to do this is to find the PIDs. So pgrep Tmux shows me three different process IDs. There's one server and two clients running. So I'm just going to run the command kill minus nine dollar to tell my kill command to extract the values within these parentheses. And I'll hit enter again. Okay, now if I bring up a new window and I type tmux, my new settings are now being honored. And these ones are just kind of remnants of my previous tmux session. To show you the persistent nature, I'll go ahead and open up another window here and type tmux, 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 and so forth. And as you can see, the banner at the very, very bottom is always black with white text. This is pretty simple, but just to leave it here, all you need to do is modify this config file with the colors that you like. And then if you wish to change these colors during a currently active Tmux session, you would use the prefix key, control B, followed by the colon, and then you insert your command here. So that's it. Thank you for watching. On the next video, I will show you how to extract data from commands to use that as part of setting up your Tmux environment. So thanks for watching.